Hi, so right now I'm going to do a quick demo on how I use Drag and Dictate with an Inkscribe. So right here, um, this is my Drag and Dictate profile, which is Nalani Dragon 1. Um, I set up this profile so that uh, Drag and Dictate could understand my speech patterns and pick up on my voice. Um, as you know, Dragon Dictate is a voice recognition software. So in order for Dragon Dictate to recognize your voice, you have to set up a profile for yourself and um, do lessons so that it picks up on um, your voice, how you pronounce certain words, things like that. So um, anybody else that wanted to use the program on my computer, um, they could set up their own profile and um, and you know do that. Let the you know, let the um, recognition software pick up on their voice and use it for the same thing. Um, so right now I'm using the standard audio source. Um, I don't have headphones plugged in because if I did, uh, you wouldn't be able to hear me very well when I'm doing the rest of the demo. So I'm just going to click on this because this is the source that I want. Um, if you have headphones in, um, you could click on that. Or if you have a USB headset in, you could click on that. Um, so I'm going to continue. And then I'm going to go up here and um, just real quickly show you the voice training that I had to do. Um, so that, you know, Dragon Dictate would understand my, um, my speech patterns. So right here, um, are, these are four, um, voice training kind of, you know, written stories that Dragon Dictate wants you to read out loud. Um, I'm just going to choose this one just to show you exactly, um, how it works. So I chose this one. I'm going to go to the next slide, um, and I'm going to press this red button to enable my microphone. So I'm going to read this right here. The following are some sample sentences from email messages, period. Please read out loud as if you were dictating to the software colon and not too soft, comma, not too loud, comma, clearly but at a normal speed, period. So um, this picked up on my voice, as you can see, because it turned green. Before, when I was speaking, it turned red, um, as it will just right now, because um, right now I'm not actually saying this sentence so it doesn't pick up on my speech pattern. Um, regardless of how fast or how slow I went, I was trying to go fast to show you, it will pick up on your speech pattern and just kind of uh, make it work for the software. So I'm going to go ahead and click out of this and then show you how Dragon Dictate works in Inkscribe. So as you can see right up here, this is my drag and dictate icon. Um, I press red when I don't want it to pick up my speech patterns and I press um, green when I want it to start writing. Um, I already have an Inkscribe document open so I'm just going to go ahead and pull this up. So um, I already showed you how Inkscribe worked and I have a, um, a little YouTube clip but I wanted to go ahead and show you how I use it in Drag and Dictate. So I could put a timestamp here, um, and then I could press this button. When I press this button, Inkscribe will automatically pick up on my speech, and it'll start transcribing, um, which for some reason it's not doing right now, um, so I'm going to have to see what's going on. So I'm going to click out of there, go to Drag and Dictate. Um, this is one problem I've had with the software. Um, sometimes you have to go to pre preferences and um, change your preferences so that um, you know the software um, knows where exactly it's typing into. So I'm just going to go to dictation and um, make sure that these boxes are not checked because I want to use it with an ink scribe. So I'm going to click out of here, go back here, and see if this works now. Okay, so okay, so it is working. So as you can see, as I'm speaking, the software picks up on my voice and it actually writes out whatever I'm saying within Inkscribe. Um, I could, um, obviously it doesn't know what Inkscribe is, so I have to either go back and show the program what Inkscribe is or um, I could just go back and edit it as I see fit. Um, like I said, nothing is 100%, um, so no matter what, I'm going to have to go back and edit um, what I'm doing um, regardless. As you can see, it picks up pretty easily with my voice. So I'm going to go ahead and turn this off. 
um, and go back and just delete this. And um, so this is basically kind of wraps up how I use Drag and Dictate in Inkscribe. If you have any questions, then please contact me. And thank you for listening to my demo.